What's going on everybody? Welcome to RNG Crypto. It's your boy here with you for another video and in this video we are covering a very special project called Attack Wagon, a blockchain gaming studio and one of their games coming out very soon here called Scrap Guilds. This game looks amazing. It is space themed open world. Before we jump into the details though, let me make sure I hit you with my disclaimer guys. I am not a financial advisor. Anything I say should never be taken as such. Please make sure you're always, always, always doing your own due diligence and research before investing any money. With that said, let's jump right into this topic. Whew, I am so excited. Let's get into it. So I'm here on their website and right off the bat, I mean, the artwork looks amazing. The UI, I love the way that it's designed. I think that the structure of the website itself and the way that the information flows as I read through this was very easily uh, consumed and definitely their white paper is also straight to the point, but very informative. Uh, and it does only focus on scrap gills, but that's okay. We'll talk about that here in a second, guys. I just want to make sure that I differentiate to you what Attack Wagon is. Attack Wagon itself is not a game. Attack Wagon is a gaming studio and they are going to have or develop multiple games on top or as part of their overall umbrella which is going to be attack wagon so let's make sure that you guys are aware that again this is not like investing into one single game you invest in attack wagon you're going to also invest or gain exposure to all of the games underneath it very similar to gala games uh, guys here it is play to earn games attack wagon is a blockchain game studio creating unique worlds packing them full of meaty lore and then smothering them in delicious artwork so again they are making it very clear that they are a gaming studio and one of the games that i'll be talking about here today is going to be scrap guilds we'll get into that here in a second before we do so let's talk a bit about some of their uh, partners and you can see here this is their list uh, definitely an extensive list and i'm sure this is going to grow over time as they continue to grow as a project but one of the ones or some of the ones Ones that are standing out to me right now polygon uh theron network x21 capital guys roseon finance cedify fund lithium these are all very very well established uh, partners that they have partnered with and that just gives me as an investor peace of mind knowing that they have such good uh, technical and financial backers because this is going to give them the funds uh, and technical backing that they need in order to succeed right allowing them or giving them more runway for the future so i know that this project is not going to crash and burn because they have the technical and financial backing they need in order to succeed in order to complete or fulfill the mission that they have in mind or the vision that they have in mind so as an investor i like to see this list of partners and not only their partners but looking at their team they have a very extensive team so here's the attack wagon team and you can see here they are fully doxxed uh, they have many it's a very extensive and diverse team which i love they have all kinds of roles already socially community lead blockchain developers world artists concept artists equipment artists 3d artists all kind of artists guys <laughs> unity developers uh, a quest writer just focusing on all the quests this is all this person is responsible for which is awesome a music composer voice actor accounting they have advisors again x21 maven risk and compliance advisors uh, so definitely a very very extensive and fully docs as well as i mean experienced team guys so that is something that you definitely want to look for guys when you are investing in projects and i'm liking the fact that uh, tag wagon definitely has a good strong team but let's get to the meat of bones of this let's get to the fun part right the scrap guilds game this game looks pretty amazing i have to say that and i like it because it is open themed right it's an open space themed game so you have an open world without limits that you can explore and actually the more you explore according to their white paper uh, the more you are able to benefit sometimes you benefit more just from exploring than actually doing some of the quests which is cool i mean you know it suits different types of players right you're not just grinding quests you know or daily quests which they are going to be daily quests as well uh, in addition to just the storyline uh, but so you know there's different types of players out there uh, and this game caters to all kinds of them so that is a positive in my eyes and what it is here it is that bring in the scraps upgrade your ship explore the expanse so scrap guilds is a scrap smuggling space shooter the thousands of grand scale battles fought during the great schism have created a good business for scrappers like you the tech and magical resources in these wrecks are valuable so valuable they could tip the balance of the war build your ship upgrade it from the scrap 
fight off alien races and other scrappers moving in on your spoils, in the Black Expanse there are no rules. Shoot it, gather it and sell it before your enemies get to you first. So again, this is the kind of game where you have to uh, find scraps, collect them and then you can sell them or use them to upgrade your ship. Uh, and that is actually a fun type of game to play. I mean, there are definitely games out there today that are not play to earn that are similar. Uh, nothing so much in the space uh, environment, but also uh, like you know basic MMOs like World of Warcraft. Basically, you're you're grinding, you're walking around, you're you're finding items, you're building things, you're crafting items, and you're then selling those on the auction house for fake money, not real money. In this case, you have uh, a marketplace as well in game that's going to be on the space station where it's going to be this giant space station basically uh, where everybody or that sort of acts as a hub that everyone flocks to uh, to go and trade their items. Whether uh, there are going to be two factions as well. So I'm not sure if the marketplace is going to be between the two factions or if there's one for each i don't know that yet i'm gonna ask that question uh, but basically there's land sales that are going to uh, provide plots of land on these giant space stations a second but there i mean there's a lot of cool stuff happening with this game uh, and i'm just very excited to be a part of it uh well not so much involvement directly with the team but uh, as an investor and as a player hopefully in the future as well so i've definitely already bought my attack tokens and by the way we're gonna go and in get into how you can buy attack tokens because right now i i mean not financial advice again but it's a pretty damn good time to buy some attack tokens. Uh, with that said, let's jump into a trailer that I want to show you just a quick idea of what the gameplay will look like. So there's an entire trailer, but just to give you an idea, here are some spaceships and it's going to give us an idea of what it looks like in the open world. I like the graphics, I think it looks really good, just giving us some examples of all the different things you can do, uh, collecting scraps like that just now, being attacked by uh, some of the aliens out in open space, so some of the dangers of being out there on your own. Uh, definitely want to be able to be equipped to, to fend off those kinds of things and you know for what it is this is definitely top quality i like the open concept i like the way that the graphics are looking here in this example uh, so definitely something i want to get into but let's not spend too much time here you can check out this entire trailer if you want let's jump right back over to the website so I did want to cover just really quickly some of the more detailed uh, things that you can do in the game. I'm not going to spend too much time here. This is their white paper and this white paper is very clear and concise. I definitely recommend you come in here if you really want to know more about this game. Uh, so you can see here the world, right? They have a lore, they have two factions, the Woven, ex a woven Expanse uh, as well as the Emancipated Star Realms. Uh, there's going they do talk about the different realms uh, in the galaxy or in the game. Uh, I'm not going to dive into any of that. Uh, they talk about the experience, but what I want to focus on is the ship part. So here are some of the things you can actually do uh, on how you can actually upgrade your ship. Uh, so there are different uh, types of, um, uh, I guess, magical bonuses uh, that you can find out in the world that are unique. Uh, and there are also different types of ships. So there are, diff there are 10 different classes of ships uh, and each of them is described here. I'm not gonna go through them all, uh, but they all have their own strengths. Uh, and so you can have a ship that's really basically like a tank or that negates damage. You can have a ship that does damage. You can have a ship that's really quick for like some of the races. So one of the ideas that they're coming up with is actually being able to participate in PVP racing. Uh, so you're not just always doing scraps, you're also racing other players, other real world players uh, and trying to claim rewards that way. Uh, so there are different part types. Uh, so you can find cockpits, noses, engines, chassis, as well as augmented reactors or augment reactors. Uh, there are extensions, weapons, bots, extras, uh, so and there are different tiers for what you can find, ranging from common to uncommon, rare, epic, legendary. Uh, so these are just a little bit of the details. I'm not going to cover it uh, bit by bit, but I do want you or uh, would recommend that you come in here and take a look at what they have here in terms of the different types of ship parts. Uh, and then the magic in the expanse. So this, these are the magical items that you can find. Uh, there's arcane, divine, control, null, and death. And each of them have uh, a sort of a strength and a weakness uh, and you can probably combat some with others uh, so maybe divine like, sort of negates death or something like this is just me speculating uh, but definitely really cool concept here uh, and I'm, I'm actually kind of interested in the death magic and i would like to uh, deck out my spaceship with parts that are uh, infused or imbued with death magic it sounds kind of cool what you can do uh, and there's a mystery because you don't know exactly what other 
powers lie within death magicka. So that's really interesting to me. There's no magic, which sort of is a kind of negate stuff. Uh, there's divine magic, which allows you to heal. Uh, so there's definitely a lot of things that are a lot of thought behind this entire game. And I really like, again, how they outline all of this in their white paper. So definitely come and take a look at this, uh, guys. And then finally, I want to talk a little bit about the token. So looking at the attack token, we can see here it is an ERC-20 token. However, don't be alarmed. This is not on Ethereum. It's actually going to be on Polygon, a layer 2 to Ethereum giving us those low gas fees and much much quicker transaction speed so that is definitely a plus when I think about the token itself in addition we have a total supply of 1 billion tokens I'm not gonna go through all of the details I will talk to you about the actual IDO price which is 2.5 cents keep that in mind as we talk about how to actually go about buying the attack token but the IDO price of attack wagon was 2.5 cents check all right, so let's look at the integration of the attack token. This attack token is basically the found fundamental or foundational token of the attack wagon ecosystem that's going to be right so as mentioned attack wagon is a studio that's going to develop multiple games uh, and all of these games are going to have exposure or use the attack token so if you are invested in the attack token you are not only invested in one game you are invested in multiple games that are in or part of the attack wagon ecosystem so that's a good thing for me as an investor guys and time vault so this is basically a way to stake in game so the scrap guilds game will have a way for you to stake in game using the time vault and the longer you stake the more rewards or the more multipliers you will receive on your rewards however that is not coming out until the game launches however there are really really good news that are just hot and fresh off the press and that is roseon finance will actually provide several ways to stake and earn rewards earn yield on the attack token and let's go ahead and take a look at that guys attack wagon staking is happening and starting on the 17th of december so that is tomorrow time of this recording that will be tomorrow take a look here there are several options number one there's the stake and draw which is basically if you're not familiar with the roseon app uh, there's a way to stake and be part of a lottery so while you're staked you are getting the percentage apy in addition to once that staking period is over which is 14 days you are uh, in a part of a lottery pool where you have a chance to win 3,000 attack tokens so that's pretty cool uh, there's no I mean for me that's a no-brainer if I have attack tokens why not I'm gonna put some in there in order to uh, be part of that lottery and win potentially another 3,000 tokens the other option is locked staking where you lock your tokens for 30 90 or 180 days for 20 30 or 40 percent APY uh, respectively uh, that's also a good option and then you have an attack farm where you actually provide liquidity of attack and wrapped ether ethereum uh, on the polygon chain and then uh, you will send those uh, liquidity pool or lp uh, tokens from your metamask wallet for example to your wallet in the uh, roseon app uh, and we'll you know i've shown that before but i can go over that here in another video in more detail uh, but basically it's it's a very simple process uh, so once you send those in there you just stake them inside the app uh, and we'll get a pretty high yield typically usually liquidity pools or liquidity pool farms are the highest yielding farms so that's another option and then finally you have the roseon farm where you can farm roseon tokens and get attack tokens uh, in return as a reward uh, so this i mean is awesome news i like that they have already provided us an option or ability to start staking attack tokens to multiply those tokens that we can then take into the game uh, and do what we need to in order to uh, progress successfully uh, so again this is happening on the roseon finance app go ahead and check out my referral link down in the description uh, use it to create yourself an account and then take advantage of this early staking rewards guys and that is it for the staking piece let's jump right into how to actually go about buying the attack token so the place that i always like to start as always is coin gecko and here i have a good overview or get a good sense of what the tokenomics are of a project that i'm investing in in this case the market cap is not yet here because it is such a new token however look at the 24 hour trading volume it is 1.2 million that is significant this being a new project that means there is some interest behind this project and people are trading the token uh, that's a green flag in my book uh, obviously here we see the uh, max supply of 1 billion but what do we need to pay attention to we need one 
where to buy this token and two we need the contract address which is right here so i'm going to go ahead and copy the contract address and i'm going to scroll down to exchanges and we can see here you can buy it on gate io and you can also buy it on quick swap i like to stay off of centralized exchanges i like to stay on decentralized exchanges so i'm going to give you an example of quick swap uh, the first thing that i would do a lot of you guys are probably wondering how do you even get your tokens onto polygon I like to use cross swaps for that and that is a simple and quick way uh, to migrate tokens. There are other options. Quick swap itself has a bridge as well, uh, but I just like to stick to uh, cross swaps because it's just so simple. So basically if I had BUSD uh, on Binance Smart Chain, I would go in here and maybe migrate over 20 BUSD onto Polygon and you can also do this from Ethereum to Polygon and Velas to Polygon, but I'm going to do it uh, from Binance Smart Chain. I'm actually not going to do it here, but this is what you would do uh, when you click swap. It sort of does it here and uh, it will actually go ahead and transfer it for you. And once the transfer is complete, uh, what you'll do is go to quick swap. And I'm going to leave all these links down in the description, so don't worry about that. Uh, but once you're on quick swap, uh, the thing you want to look at, it's going to start with Matic as, you, as your uh, starting point. And you can see here, I'm not yet uh, on the Polygon network for my MetaMask. So I got to make sure that I change my MetaMask over uh, to Polygon. So once I've done that, uh, now I can see I've got a little bit of Matic here just for transaction fees. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use USDC uh, to purchase a few uh, coins of uh, Attack Wagon. So what I'll do here is I'll paste in the address for Attack Wagon. I'll go ahead and hit add. And then you can see here, I've got my attack here. I already have a little bit here that I've purchased earlier. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and buy all $14 of my USDC uh, for attack and go ahead and hit swap. Confirm swap. It's going to take me into my MetaMask. I'm going to confirm there. And it's as simple as that, guys. As soon as this transaction is complete, what I can do now, or once uh, the staking on Roseon app goes live, I'm going to be sending all of my tokens uh, from Roseon app or excuse me, from my MetaMask into the Roseon app, uh, or I'll probably not all of them, I'll probably uh, do a liquidity pool for half of them. Uh, and that's what the video is going to be that I'll follow up with. But basically, that is it. That's how you purchase it. Again, you can purchase it on QuickSwap, which is the decentralized exchange for Polygon. You can also purchase it on Gate.io uh, if you are a member there. Uh, and I hope uh, that that is definitely clear to you guys if you have questions go ahead and leave them down in the comment jump into my telegram group uh, where we like to back each other up the community is great there uh, they are always there ready to help answer if i'm not around to answer those questions for you guys but that's it for me guys that's it for the video i hope that this was informative i hope you liked the content if you did like the content hit the like hit the subscribe guys attack wagon is a project to be reckoned with they will come out strong guys and make sure that you are taking advantage of the low price not financial advice but guys 2.5 cents for the ido now at three cents guys so it's barely up from the ido you are definitely in at a right time so make sure that you're taking advantage of it guys with that said hit the like hit the subscribe guys i will see you in the next video peace out